notice that the sounds you hear in the city sometimes seem to be just noise, but then turn out to be music? Fudge, wait till we get home. I want to play my song, Kate. Oh, you can do your singing once we get back to the apartment. Besides, you can't play without batteries, train brain. so beautifully. I just sort of picked it up as I went along. It just came naturally, I guess. <laughs> Musicians are so cool. Peter, is it hard being a music superstar and flying all over the world, missing your friends? Hey, I bring my friends with me. It's cool, right, guys? Yeah, cool. Very cool. Except I get sick on airplanes sometimes. Well, I do. So, are you going to play for us? Well, I really haven't prepared anything, but I'll tell you what. I'll just make something up. Count and send a check. Peter! Oh, please, may I have your autograph? A uh, lock of your hair? Okay, forget the hair. Just uh, breathe on me. Just breathe on me. Oh, oh, your lint. A piece of your lint in your actual sleeve. I'll treasure it forever. I am so sorry. I, I don't know how she got past security. Hey, it's okay. If a piece of my lint can make a fan that happy, I'm glad I can make the sacrifice. Peter! 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 Peter. 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 Huh? We're going home now. Oh, okay. So, how'd you like to play like that guy? That'd be great. Oh, Susan, oh, don't you cry for me. I come from a banana with red you on my knee. It's not I come from a banana, it's I come from Alabama. Why? Oh, I come from a banana with red you on my knee. Batteries sure last a long time. Tell me about it. Hey, come down to the lobby with me. I want to show you something. What's going on, Dad? You'll see, you'll see. Hi, Peter. Hey. Mr. H. Nice timing. How are you doing, Henry? Well, what do you think? About what? You didn't notice? The light. Yeah, I probably ought to fix that. I did. Remember these dingy 40-watt light bulbs? Well, I replaced them with 150-watt sun lamps. It's a proven medical fact that brief exposure to sunlight, especially during the, the dark winter months, can actually make you happier. <laughs> yeah, but aren't they kind of bright, though? Yeah, isn't it great? What do you think? How do you feel? Like a plate of french fries? But happier, right? <laughs> Is this for us? For you. After we watched those street musicians, your mom and I talked and decided to rent this so you could learn to play. Stradivarius. Listen, Tchaikovsky, you can play it the minute we get it upstairs. You're the piano movers? No, we're delivering a really big pizza. And you, sir, whoever you are, would you uh, make yourself useful? Henry. <laughs> we can't let them move this thing by themselves. Just peer the elevator. Go look at the more out of it. I'll push. I'll push. I'll push. I'll push. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, it's not your fault, Sonny. I'll tell you exactly what happened. 
some knucklehead put a 150 watt bulb into a socket that's only rated for a 60. Shorten out the whole thing. Sam, come here. Looks like we'll have to take the stairs. <coughs> it's all right. We'll, we'll help you. Oh, sorry. It's not necessary. We are professionals. We'll do, we'll do it ourselves. Where are those pills? Darn dizzy spells they get. Please, I insist. Don't insist, please. But if you insist, okay. Man, this is heavy. Weight means nothing. It's all angles and leverage. I wonder how long before I put out my first CD. Oh, give me a home where the buffalo roam. Come on, Dad, I'm recording. Sorry. Where the deer and the can I love play? Uh, I think that's where the antelope play, not the cantaloupe. Dad, oh. don't even try it, Dad. Where's the deer and the cantaloupe play? Fudge, I think you need a new partner. Hey, maybe when Peter starts lessons, he can team up with you. If you ever let me touch the keys. I just want to try and figure out the start of Fudge's song. Fudge, would you please cut out that racket? I'm trying to finish these bills. For once, Mom, it isn't Fudge. Nope. Don't shoot me, I'm only the piano player. <laughs> well, you could have fooled me. <sighs> Let me at this thing. Whoa, show me how to do that. Thumb, middle finger, baby finger. Thumb, middle finger, baby finger. Wow, that's without lessons. And the boy's a natural. Don't worry, guys. I won't forget you when I'm famous. You always get free tickets to my concerts. Our concerts, Pete, we're gonna make big bucks. Hello, I am Raoul Kaminsky. You must be Mr. Hatcher. Oh, yeah, and you must be the piano man. Instructor, piano instructor. Shall we begin? Mr. Kaminsky. Raul, isn't it? Um, hope you don't mind. We thought we'd watch. And I'll get it all on tape. Piano lessons are not a spectator sport. Oh, well, of course. Well, we'll just be in the back. Yeah. He doesn't smile very much, does he? Now then, I understand from your father you never played before, correct? Well, not exactly. I mean, it's no big deal or anything. But, I just learned it last night. Really? Do you know the name of what you just played? You mean, like, what song? Mr. Hatcher, a trained chicken can memorize songs. That is not playing the piano. Now, these are your workbooks. To begin, middle C. You're not doing it right. How do you know? That didn't sound like any song I ever heard. It's not a song, it's a scale. It's a good thing I'm not recording. Nobody will ever buy my tape if you play like that. Mom! Enough. Sorry, Peter. I know you want to work. Come on, buds. Let's go. Peter needs to practice. That's for sure. Hey, I can't 
can't practice on an empty stomach, right? I'm supposed to practice my piano. For the whole afternoon? Well, I have practiced for a whole hour. I guess I've earned a break. Wait here, I'll get my mitt. Mr. Hatcher, please. Did you practice at all? Yeah, I practiced. Some. Well, you must be very talented. Not everyone can practice their scales while eating a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Peanut butter and honey. Do you want to learn the piano, Mr. Hatcher? Because if you do, you're going to have to practice. Playing the piano simply cannot be faked. How did the news affect you, Sheila? I'm stunned, simply stunned. It's his greatest fan. I feel so used. I don't know how he fooled us. I guess we were just too busy enjoying life in the fast lane to notice. There you have it. In what will surely go down as one of the greatest scandals in the history of popular music, we have learned that Peter Warren Hatcher can't play the piano at all. It turns out that all this time, he wasn't really playing. He was finger sinking. I should have picked something easier, like nuclear physics. P, we need to talk. I don't think it's gonna work out. I decided to be a famous singer all by myself. What are you talking about? You don't fool me, P. You wouldn't even want to play. You're not even trying. Twinkle, twinkle, little car. Hey, kid, doing your piano homework? That's great. How's it going? Oh, okay, except my brother just kicked me out of the band. <laughs> Decided to go solo, huh? Well, it's for the best. You guys have very different musical styles, you know. Mm. So, I haven't had a chance to listen to you play that much. How about tickling the wee ivories for me? <laughs> I don't know. Huh? Come on. Don't, what's, what's going on? Come on. Play anything. I really don't know anything. Oh, come on. Don't be so modest. Uh, play a scale. Wh whatever you want. Come on. Come on. Pretty hard. My fingers get kind of mixed up. <laughs> Are you kidding? It was great. <laughs> I'm really proud of you. Thanks. Keep it up. Okay. The itty weensy spider went up the water trout. Never wanted to take these stupid piano lessons. I'm only doing it because my dad wants me. To. <laughs> Pete, I'm trying to sing here. You know, Fudge, I think the song goes up the water route, not water trout. Isn't it water drought? Spout! It's water spout. No, that's not it either. Maybe it's water grout. Anyway, Peter, you can't expect to be good without practice. Take my French lesson. Do we have to? I'm saying, even though I do have a natural talent for languages, it took dedication for me to be able to speak Francais as beautifully as I do now. Comprendez-vous? Yeah, and like I used to be a really bad chess player. Then my dad told me to keep at it, and now I'm a lot better. And he's really proud of me. Except, he won't play with me anymore, because I always beat him. Well, you want to play chess. I don't want to play the piano. I'd do the work if I cared about it, but I don't. I mean, one minute I'm watching some musician, the next minute my dad's making me take these lessons. Boy, it's a good thing you weren't watching one of those guys who juggles chainsaws. Whew. <laughs> Maybe your dad will see it's just a waste of time once he realizes you have absolutely no talent. I mean, anyone who listens to you can tell you're just plain no good. Yeah. Gee, thanks, guys. I feel much better. No problem. 
Well, I guess it is sort of true. I mean, nobody else in my family has any musical talent either. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and now for one of my greatest hits. On top of spaghetti, all covered with cheese. I lost my poor meatball with somebody's seeds. Fudge, time to eat. Put down your tape recorder and wash up. I'm done making my tape. I want to play my songs for you. Ah, uh, music, dinner, it's like being at a nightclub. Except we have to do our own dishes. <laughs> Excuse me. I was checking you out from across the room. Can I buy you a drink, bartender? A ginger ale for the lovely lady. I'm a great singer at the park. People even gave me money. Yeah, they probably paid you to stop singing. No, sir, let's do this, Pete. It's okay. it's okay. Yes, I wanted you to take lessons. I never got to when I was a kid, and I thought I'd give you the chance. Maybe I should have asked you. Dad, I did say I wanted to be like that guy who we saw in the band. Who won it? He was really cool, but... I'd hate to see you quit just because it's hard. I never said I wanted to quit because it was hard. Well, then why? Because I never wanted to play the piano in the first place. Hmm. You're not supposed to eat while you play. The crumbs get stuck in the keys. Oh, hi. Just messing around a little, you know. Before the movers come, take it away. Uh. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> That's not how you play that scale. What? Your right hand was over too far. Here. Now, back to middle C. Start here. Okay. I think I see. You start right here. Mm -hmm. Hey, that was pretty good. Well, just because my hands are a little bigger, that's all. Sounded okay, though? Yeah, it wasn't too bad. You'd probably be better if you had a few lessons, though. Hey, guys. Hey, Pete. I'm going to carry the piano all by myself. That's right, kid. Just remember what I told you. Angles and leverage. It's smart, kid. Um, I don't know how to say this, guys, but I don't think we're going to need your services. Oh, I was just kidding with the kid. That's all I was doing. I mean, my son changed his mind. He thinks we ought to keep this piano for a little while longer. Sorry if you made the trip over here for nothing. <laughs> Wasn't for nothing. We charged for travel time. Where did you come from? Coney Island. Milwaukee. Mil Coney. Yeah, Milwaukee, that's where we go. You guys are just being funny again, right? <laughs> These days, you can't earn a living by just being funny. <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here. <laughs> well, now, wait a minute. Now you want to keep the piano? Yeah. I mean, we can't get rid of it now. Dad's just getting the hang of it. <laughs> and don't worry, I'll make sure he practices. Mm -hmm. 